Unit 1, Overview of Canada. Canada is a vibrant and multicultural society made up of diverse people. Canada is a country that values and respects diversity. Canadian law applies equally to everyone. People in Canada are expected to show tolerance and respect towards all people, regardless of their age, gender, race, social class, marital or family status, language, religion, nationality, immigration status, sexual orientation, and ability or disability. Discrimination prevents people from doing things that others can do freely. To discriminate against someone means to treat them unequally from other people and in a way that is negative. Canadian laws make it illegal to treat others badly or unfairly because of who they are. People in Canada recognize that discrimination exists. Despite Canada being a multicultural and accepting place, one in five people in Canada has experienced discrimination. Discrimination sometimes leads to violence. Violent acts of discrimination are not common in Canada, but are a serious violation of the law. Discrimination can happen in different forms. Sometimes it is easy to recognize. Other times, it is more hidden. Look at some examples of discrimination. What country are you from? Go back home. Discrimination based on nationality. Our team does not allow players to cover their heads. You cannot play. Discrimination based on religion. Elevator broken. Discrimination based on disability. Two men holding hands in public. Shameless. Discrimination based on who you love and sexual orientation. Women can't do this job. Discrimination based on gender. People like you can't buy things here. Discrimination based on gender identity. If people like them keep moving here, the neighborhood will become unsafe. Discrimination based on race. Discrimination can take the form of day-to-day -day experiences involving subtle slights or insults. Some of these insults include being treated as not smart, being treated as suspicious, being mistaken for a service worker, or being treated unfairly while accessing services. In Canada, you have the right to respectfully question situations or practices that you feel are discriminatory. Look at the recommendations on how to handle discrimination in Canada. Think about your strengths. Talk to someone you trust. If possible, tell the person doing it to stop. Try to write down the details of what happened during an incident, including the names, dates, times, and places. This will show there is a pattern of discriminatory behavior. You can seek help from a mental health professional. You can call the non-emergency phone number of the local police for guidance. If you are in danger, call 911 for the police and emergency services. If the harassment happens at work, check if your employer has an anti-harassment policy and follow its instructions. Keeping an open mind by being flexible and tolerant of other people's differences will help you while you adjust to life in Canada. This can be done through being respectful in your actions and words, respecting all people's right to live as they wish, even if it differs from the way you live.